a quick little video about uh, spells, magic, after effects, long-term effects, etc. So this was recently brought to my attention and a question that was asked because, you know, things in their life um, today I have um, not worked out or whatever and okay let me just get to the point <laughs> you're probably like what is this bitch talking about um so when you do a spell especially like a love spell or even a destructive spell or whatever it may be but this focuses more on love okay so if you're going to be doing magic on someone like a binding or a love spell or whatever it may be to that effect um and then the person comes back but then it still doesn't work out because you're just kind of you fell out of love with them so first and foremost let me make it clear when you do binding on someone it makes it harder for the person to leave it doesn't say that they can't leave you because they can and they will if you act like an idiot but it makes it harder for them to stay away permanently like they'll go in and out of your life um especially if you mess it up right and things aren't hunky-dory you have to fix the problem right you can't just put a band-aid over it and expect it to be okay most people put band-aids and they think it's okay um so if you don't fix the problem the person leaves again but they will always end up returning because you have a binding on the particular individual but by the time they return or so much in and out sometimes we fall out of love with the person and we don't want them anymore and then we try to start anew with somebody else and if it doesn't go right um is it because we did spell work on someone else so to answer that question partially it can be but most of the times it's because we have grown as a person okay so yes we did a binding on someone else we are spiritually bound to the other person um therefore you're drawn to that other target you're drawn to your initial person you did the love work on and everybody else is kind of secondary so in a way yeah it does affect you but on the flip side of the coin if you fall out of love with that person you don't want to be with the person you did the spell work on then it's kind of not affected because at the end of the day everyone has free will you have free will the target has free will and no matter what magic you do if a person is hell bent on i'm not going to be with this person i don't want this person they're not going to be with you everyone has free will so does it affect today how you are reacting to potentially new people uh not so much and the reason is because you have grown as a person to know what you do not want and the people that are now trying to come into your life because you've had a bad past experience due the due to the other person treating you bad you don't want that no more you see the red flags you know the red flags they're in your face so it's not the past spell or any love spell that you've done on somebody else that's causing relationships today to fail it's because they're failing because you don't tolerate the bullshit i hope that helps for all those that worry about doing magic it's not the past spell it's you you have grown as a woman or a man many blessings to you